Hey, it's Marco here from uh, Fair Realty. It's February 1st, uh, 2021. I'm here with your update uh, for January uh, 2021. It was another insane, uh, crazy month. I really don't know what to say at this point. Uh, sales compared to last year up uh, 57% in terms of the number of sales, 646. This is the highest number in the last 30 years. The only higher uh, month was uh, January 1990, 31 years ago. Had a few more sales than we had uh, this January. Single family home market is just off the rails. The median shot up to 970,000. Uh, previously, the highest median ever on record last year was 907. The average price of a single family home, over $1.2 million. Uh, last year, we never even cleared 1.1, so we went uh, straight through the 1.1 and now over 1.2 million. That is kind of uh, crazy and disturbing at the same time. So there's no inventory. There is a huge amount of demand for single family homes. Uh, in January, I saw houses with 19 offers, 15 offers, uh, 12 offers. I had many clients writing unconditional above asking offers and not even being close to what the property uh, would sell for. The, the demand for single family is just, I, I don't know what to say. And there's no inventory. And the interesting thing is, if you look at the last 10 years in terms of new listings for detached homes, it's been a steady trend down. So over the last 10 years, less and less people are selling single family homes, but there appears to be more and more uh, demand. Uh, the condo market up a bit. Uh, I think the median was uh, 440. The average last year was about 429, so up a bit. Uh, uh, the average price was also up a bit on condos, but nothing too crazy. You can still buy a condo uh, usually without getting into a bidding war and usually with having some contingencies in terms of uh, conditions. Um, inventory, new listings coming to market was actually half reasonable. It was compared to last year, but that doesn't mean much because sales were higher than the 57% than last year. So even though we had comparable new listings to last year, when you have 57% more sales, there's not going to be a lot of choice uh, out there. And active inventory is at 1,300 and something, extremely, extremely uh, low. Uh, it would take a really a sustained, very, very slow market for inventory to recover over the course of 6 to 12 uh, months. So at this point, I honestly really don't know what to tell uh, people anymore. It's absolutely nuts out there. I'm hoping it slows down. I'm hoping the massive bidding wars dissipate, and I'm hoping people, once again, are going to be able to shop for houses and make educated decisions and do some due diligence and instead of this absolute mania, frenzy, whatever you want to call it. That's it for this week. Marco Juras, Fair Realty.